Hello, my name is Maria and this is Matty, my mascot. In this lesson we're going to study adding and subtracting whole tens. For example here, I have four tens and here I have three tens. So we're going to write an addition. Four tens I write as 40, right? And then I add three tens, which is 30. So how much do I get in total? I would get seven tens. And that is written as 70, 70, right? Let's try another one over here. This one, two tens is two and zero, 20. And then one, two, three, four, five, six tens is 60. And so what do we get when we add? We get eight tens, right, 80. Now let's try that one. Here's 10, right? And then here, nine tens and what do we get when we add those ten and nine tens makes ten tens but what do we call that it's like sticking them all together and they they snap together and they become this hundred flat they become a hundred now let's try subtracting over here i have 70 if i take away 50 that means i take away five tens. Let's say that I just cross them out. One, two, three, four, five tens are crossed out, so what is left? Two tens, or twenty. Same here. If I have sixty and I take away this much, three tens, or thirty. That ten, that ten, and that ten are crossed out, so I have thirty left. Right. Lastly, here's a hundred. If I take away 40, what will be left? I can still cross out tens. See, here's a 10. This one column is a 10. And another 10. And a third one. And a fourth one. If I cross out four tens, what do I have left? Six tens. Yes, 60. If you didn't catch it already, here is the principle. 50 plus 30 is the same as 5 tens plus 3 tens. You add 5 plus 3, so that is 8. But they are 8 tens, you're adding tens. 8 tens is 8. Oh, the same with subtraction. 80 minus 40, 8 tens minus 4 tens. Subtract 8 minus 4, that's just 4. But you are subtracting the tens, so the answer is 4 tens or 40. Now here I have a few practice problems. Try them on your own. Post a video and try if you can solve this. Okay, 70 plus 20. It's like 7 plus 2, which is 9. But we have 9 tenths, so it is 90. 80 minus 10. It's like 8 minus 1, which would be 7. But I put the 0 there because we have 70 as our answer. 100 minus 20. 100 is 10 tens, so 10 tens take away 2 tens is 8 tens, 80. 30 plus 50, remember 3 plus 5, the answer is 80. And then 50 minus 40, think of 5 minus 4, we get 1 ten left. And then 100 minus 60, again think of 10 tens minus 6 tens, 10 minus 6, 4, 4 tens are left, 40. Lastly, Matthew is giving you this challenge. He wrote it and he wants you to try to solve it. So take a minute. There's a trick to it. Okay, the trick is that some of those numbers, when we add them, make 10. For example, 5 and 5 here. I can pair them, I can add them. They make 10. Then here, 8 and 2. And one more such pair, 7 here and 3 here. Those make 10. So now it's really easy to add because I got 10 and 10 and 10. So there's 3 tens. And then there's 10 and 40. So we get 40 and 40, which is 80. So did you solve it? I hope so. We're all done with this lesson.